Hey guys, what's up? I am back with a brand new video and it's time to do a speed test comparison between the Oppo F21 Pro versus the Infinix 05G and the Infinix 05G is powered by MediaTek Dimensity 900 processor with 8GB of RAM while the Oppo F21 Pro is powered by Qualcomm Snapdragon 680 processor with 8GB of RAM on the back. We have triple cameras on both phones. We have 48 megapixel main camera. Also, we have 13 megapixel, which is a telephoto lens, which gave you a 2x optical zoom. Lastly, we have a 2 megapixel depth sensor. While on the Oppo, we have 64 megapixel main camera. Also, we have 2 megapixel depth sensor and a 2 megapixel, which is a microscope lens, which we don't see in this price range before. Also, around this camera, we have a ring light, which we don't see again in this price range. And the back of the Oppo is made up of glass while the Infinix especially in this orange color we have leather tie finish while the another color is give you a plastic back and the frame on both phones is made up of plastic and the frame of the Oppo is completely flat which gives a more premium feel over the Infinix 05G also we have in-display fingerprint scanner on the Oppo while on the Infinix we have fingerprint scanner on the side on the bottom we also have a headphone jack on both these two devices although we have single speaker on both phones so in this video i'm going to show you how is the oppo f21 pro is stack up against the infinix 05g in apps opening speed as well as in the boot up test so without any wasting time let's get right into it and guys now let's quickly boot both of these phones up at the same time here we go logos came up first on the infinix as compared to the oppo also, we have Android 11 with XOS version 10 versus Android 12 with the color OS version 12.1. Later software on the Oppo and the Infinix is more faster when it comes to booting up by a huge margin. While the Oppo is taking a lot of time and you can see we have a new color OS on the Oppo. But still Oppo is taking a lot of time and the Qualcomm Snapdragon 680 is not the fastest in this price range so now the Oppo it is also done about 8 or 9 second difference there between these two devices when it comes to booting up and guys now let's talk about the displays between these two devices on the Oppo we have 6.4 inch Full HD plus AMOLED display with 90Hz refresh rate while on the Infinix we have 6.7 inch Full HD plus IPS LCD display with 120Hz refresh rate and both phones also has a punch hole which is on the center on the Infinix as compared to on the left hand side on the Oppo and the Oppo also has a IPX4 rating which we don't see on the Infinix so now let's see apps opening speed everything's closed up in the background no application is running in the background also we have same Wi-Fi network on both phones now let's start off with the phone dialer more faster on the Infinix again we have different animation so now let's opening up settings faster on the Infinix let me go to the display on both phones and you can see we have 120 hertz refresh rate versus a 90 hertz on the oppo now check out some more application opening up amazon shopping with same wi-fi network and the infinix is and you can see is super super faster there now let's see the scrolling and that is face a little more smoother on the infinix if i see very closely but oppo it is also really very really smooth and difference between 90 hertz and 120 hertz is not that much but obviously more smoother on the infinix very same as well this time now check out some games application opening up the candy Crush saga again Qualcomm snapdragon 680 versus intimacity 900 exactly the same on both phones so let me show you the speaker here is the oppo looks like with a single speaker max volume Yes, and the single speaker it is also really good on the Oppo, but dual speaker in, in this price range is must, but no dual speakers. And the Infinix has a really bad speaker, so Oppo is a clear winner in that area, but still only single speaker. Instagram faster on the Infinix. Let's see pin out. Pin out also faster on the Infinix, and you can see. And the MediaTek Dimensity 900 is performing more faster in that area. Now let's opening up Snapchat faster on the Infinix. Now let's opening up the Subwoofer and 
faster on the Infinix by a huge margin because of the Dimensity 900. Now let's opening up the Temper N2. And Temper N2 is faster on the Infinix 05G. Again, we have different versions on both phones, but you can see. And the Oppo is a little more faster as compared to the Infinix. Now let's opening up the PUBG Mobile on both phones. Heavy game. Let's see this time who's faster. The game is open up more faster on the Infinix. Also, we have Infinix is done and the Oppo is taking a lot of time. Now it is also done and you can see also we have smooth graphics with extreme frame rate versus a smooth graphics with high frame rate because of the Snapdragon 680 processor. Now let's opening up the tutor that is more faster on the Infinix. Now let's opening up the Zedge and Zedge is faster on the Infinix as you can see as compared to the Oppo. Now let's see the scrolling again very very smooth on both phones not a huge difference but if I see very closely yes Infinix is a little more smoother. So last time I'm launching the cameras on both phones default camera application. Now let's see who is going to be the fastest one. Infinix is more faster as compared to the Oppo. Now let's look at the front camera. Here's the front facing camera looks like on both phones. Front camera is more sharper on the Infinix. As you can see while the Oppo has a, a lot of noise. Okay guys, now let's see internet browser speed. I am seeing to follow Google Chrome on both phones. Also, we have same Wi-Fi network opening up wikipedia.org. Little more faster on the Infinix. Now let's see the scrolling and that is face. I would say more smoother on the Infinix. Yes. So now let's open this English. Also very similar in the speed. But the scrolling is more smoother on the Infinix. Next on the list is the Apple.com and Apple.com is faster on the Oppo F21 Pro this time. So now let's see the scrolling again. Again in, in terms of the scrolling wise, a little bit lag on the Infinix in the start. But now both phones looks really really smooth. So now check out RAM management on both phones. Both phones has a 8 GPU of RAM. Both phones also has an extended RAM feature. Now let's see that who is perform good. In the RAM management, phone dialer, refresh on the Oppo, settings, no refresh, Amazon shopping, refresh on the Oppo, let's see Candy Crush Sega, Candy Crush is refresh, Instagram, seems like in-app refresh, let's see Pinout, Pinout is refresh, let's see Snapchat, refresh, Subway Surfer, refresh again on the Oppo, let's see Temper and 2, refresh, Opening up the PUBG mobile, PUBG is refreshed as you can see on the Oppo while the Infinix is performing really really good in the RAM management. Opening up the tutor, not refresh. Zedge, that seems like in-app refresh. Opening up the camera, last way back to the internet browser, refresh again on the Oppo as you can see. And guys over I have to say. Regarding the app's opening speed, as you can see that and the Infinix 05G is performing more faster in the game app during time as well as in system based application because of the MediaTek Dimensity 900 processor which is a really powerful processor in this price range while on the other hand we have Qualcomm Snapdragon 680 which is not as fast as the MediaTek Dimensity 900. In terms of the RAM image wise and the Infinix 05G is performing incredible in the RAM management while on the Oppo we have a lot of refresh. Also on the Infinix we have 5000 mAh battery size with a 33 watt fast charging while on the Oppo we have 4500 mAh battery size with a 33 watt fast charging as well. And that's about it and thank you so much for watching this speed test comparison between the Oppo F21 Pro versus the Infinix 05G. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe to my channel for daily tech videos and follow me on Instagram and Twitter as well. And I will see you in my next video. Peace out.